Okay, you know what? No, we can do this. I'm not giving up. Last time, I was getting my butt kicked. What do we want? We want Porta. Porta, you're in. Mad for yeah, Mad Forest inverse. Duration up. Let's go. Dodge the XP. Port is the only character you don't want to level up early. Maybe not the only character. Okay, why are they not dropping gems? Do they not drop as much XP in this level? In inverse land. Oh, that could be the case. I will level up soon. Soon as in never. Okay, we're gonna do this. This is the Porta gameplay. Dodge experience. Just dodge the experience. We already got a chest. With the chests, could I get experience without leveling up? Probably. There's a clock lancet here. I think I'm going Bible. Holy, that difference between level one and level two. What about pentagram? It's not pentagram. It is clock lancet. What about armor? I'm gonna take armor. The plan is to trade XP, or to trade health for XP. At least a little bit. Spellbinder's good. Bible's good. I need to go collect all of that XP up above. Give me armor. This character feels really slow. If, is my movement speed bad? Must be. Sad thing is, there isn't even that much XP. There's a bit. Food is good. I need to kill some of these skeletons. I have Clock Lancet, but right now... Eh. More food. What about the cross? No. This is not good. God, that lightning is so slow. Becomes better as I get more levels of it. That's what I'm gonna tell myself. I'm gonna get duplicator. We're gonna do craziness. But right now, I just don't do much. Got Bible. Bible's doing things. Empty tome is very important. I don't even know what this character's, like, passive is that it gets on level up. Bible's doing damage. Maybe I've been underestimating Bible lately. It was my favorite item for a long time. Maybe it should be again. Because it's kind of defensive, kind of offensive. Which is always nice. Just keep going Bible. I 
Need to get some food. It's not happening. These stupid trees. Stupid upside down trees. Okay, Clock Lancet could be my safety right now. Okay, or it could be my death. Need some food. That's cool. I didn't need those revives. That revive. All I need is some level ups. Song of Mana. Let's take it. I rely on Song of Mana too much. It's not enough damage for this. I've already tried it multiple times. It wasn't enough. But what if this time it is enough? It's another item that gives some safety. Because it does have some knockback. I'm really just trying to pop open those containers and find food. Hey, there's food. Cooldowns. That's not good. Problem is, Clock Lance, it doesn't really be good, become good for a while. Okay, so that character's not good enough. Permanent 30% area. Huh. Permanent pickup range. Plus one permanent projectile. What about you? This character does a good amount of damage. And I can take armor. And projectile speed seems decent. I don't think those are what I want. That's what I want. Or Bible. Give me Bible first. Feeling good about these levels. If I stand in those flower boxes, will my rune tracers bounce off of the walls of them? They would. So if I need to do a lot of damage in a small area, that's a way to do it. It doesn't really work. Not right now. But it could at some point. What about duplicator? I definitely want a duplicator with Rune Tracer and with Bible. Which maybe means that I should take Lightning Ring. Another bat swarm up north. There it was. Bible is good. If I get Bible transformed, I have a chance. I feel like I'm getting good XP right now. Better than I was with the other characters. Still not, like, ideal amounts. But enemies are not just building up. They are getting cleared off the screen a little bit. Get up the armor. I do need a way to heal. Think.
That's what food drops are for. Tiragasu. No. Keep getting the Rune Tracer upgrades. Rune Tracer doesn't really give me much safety, but it gets me lots of XP, which is kind of like safety. It stops things from just building up on the screen like crazy. There is a freeze. I don't really need that. I feel like I'm letting the damaged enemies off the screen and they're disappearing when I need to be killing them. Maybe I should take that freeze, then I can jump in the middle. And do a little bit of damage. Good job, Bible. Tracer and Bible. Come on. You guys can do damage. Okay, did I leave some food? There's a chest near me. I did leave a freeze. Where's that chest? Right below me. Go Rune Tracer. Rune Tracer again. I haven't gotten a weapon evolution in this stage yet. Pretty bad sign. Or maybe that just means I'm making suboptimal decisions. Effects last longer or more cooldown? I'm close to a Bible evolution. Kind of close to a Rune Tracer too. Equally close. Okay. I think Bible... I don't know which is the priority. They're both a priority. Bible feels like it gives more safety, but that's not all the way true, because if enemies are building up, I'm not safe. I don't know. And if I'm not getting XP. Rune Tracer gets me XP. So does Bible. They're both good. It's kind of weird that you can just push your way out of that ring of plants without it doing much to you. Feels like the consequences consequences should be higher. We need to start getting kills again. Also food. Armor up. Much as I want that cooldown up, I think it's armor. This is when I get lots of XP, so I have to farm... Yeah, I have to farm effectively. Bracer's really good for both of these, but I think the evolution is a priority. Not food. Okay. I see a chest. Can't really get to it yet, but I kind of can. I have a good amount of armor. Bracer's good. Why did I think that I was going to get to evolve right there? Shouldn't I have gotten to evolve right there? Very strange. Let's go cooldowns. Let's go armor. Let's go. Okay, quick pause back in a sec. 
we're back. All right, Bracer or Spellbinder? I think it's Bracer. Bracer again? Garlic is tempting. Go Bracer. Try and do some damage. Okay, I left for a second. And it feels like I'm taking damage more than I was before I left. This is what I need. I see a red gem. I see another red gem. Give me the cooldowns. This is the scary level. Did I already use my revive? I feel like I might have. I'm not doing a great job killing those ghosts, but they don't do as much damage, so I'm kind of ignoring them. I'm just trying to keep everything else knocked back out of my... Bible protection. Okay, small problem. I need food. What about Clock Lancet? Clock Lancet starts to the north, goes northeast. <laughs> its area is so small to start. Somehow... Okay, we got this. My damage is high enough. That's what I'm telling myself. If I can get some food and heal up. I'm dead. The clock lancet's just not affecting enough things. That's food. That was my only chance, and it's not enough. If I find more food, that's not food. I'm trying so hard right now. I see a box. I need that box. I can't get there. thinking for a second. Start with temporary area bonus. I really think it's you. Devano, let's go again. Is it duration up? I still think it's duration. Listen, I like garlic. Okay, garlic might be stupid. These things are so much tankier. Holy crap. Let's do this. Give me rune tracer. Not Rune Tracer. Good reroll, but we're just gonna take it. I need to save the rerolls for Arcana if I can. God, I can't even break a fire. How is this supposed to work? I have Laurel, I have Armor. We can make this work. I needed to get that Bat Swarm. It'll come back. I like that that Bat Swarm is weak, unlike the regular bats. I need those Bat Swarms to run into me. This is not it. Okay, I gotta find food. Not exactly food. Bible, let's go. Bible plus garlic. It's kind of classic.
I would take Song of Mana. Although, I've already got Santa Water. That's basically Song of Mana, except not at all. Would I take Duplicator? Yeah. Duplicator is early damage. I need early damage right now. Very badly. And I think it works with Garlic. I know it works with Bible. I know it works with Santa Water. Let's do it. So I get one more weapon. It's going to be Clock Lancet. And I do want armor, for sure. Armor's the main reason I'm taking this character. If I can get the armor high enough, maybe I can stay alive. Kinda want garlic, but Song of Mana is too good. Song of Mana actually does area damage. Like, big area. All of these work with Bracer, except for Santa Water. I'm not killing anything. That's the pattern I'm seeing repeatedly in this level. Not getting killed. Not getting kills. I think I need to take a stronger starting arcana. But I like duration up. Area up would probably be good too, but I don't have that available to me. Um, give me the attract orb. I'm just gonna pick things up from far away. That way when I do get kills, I'll get the XP. Which I can translate into more killing power. I should have just went for that bat swarm. I'm not getting kills on these enemies. Even when they're all just frozen in a swarm. The bat swarms are it. Armor was what I wanted. That helps. It's not enough. There just wasn't any XP on the ground because I'm not getting kills. There's some XP. I need Rune Tracer. I would probably take that over Clock Lancet. Would I? I needed Rune Tracer way earlier. I need something that can do enough damage to get kills. Song of Mana upgrades would also do it. Bible upgrades would kind of do it. But I can't get the upgrades if I can't get the kills. I think part of the problem is taking five weapons. One of them is Laurel, though. Which I started with. Song of Mana. Let's go. Exchanging health for hopefully some experience. Yeah, because now I'm dead. 
I do have knockback. And the wolves are pretty easy to knock back, but as soon as they get pressed up against me like that, I'm dead. I am tankier than usual. With food... That felt like it healed for more than usual again. I could take the whip here. I think I'm going to. I'm nowhere near being able to transform it, so don't even think about the heal side, but just area damage. Right now, I need area damage. Food is my only chance. There's no chance. God, this level is just brutal. Okay, I may have taken a bunch of questionable upgrades. I'm trying to think what I would take as my evolution. If I could pick one thing, what would my top choice be? God, I feel like it's Song of Mana, but maybe not. Bible? Rune Tracer. Kinda think it has to be Rune Tracer. Going again. So let's look at these. Game Killer. Gemini. Let's try this one. Right, I don't actually have those weapons. I knew that. Hey, King Bible and Rune Tracer. Um... I think I have to go Rune Tracer early. I think that gets more kills than, like, anything else. Bible gives good safety, and it gets some kills, but not as many. This also gets kills, but that's not, like, a huge priority. Binder. Let's do it. Hoping for Rune Tracer levels. Duplicator would be a priority. Because of that, maybe I take Lightning Ring if I get it offered. Lightning Ring is good AoE damage late game. Like, as good as Santa Water may be better. Hard to say. They're both very good. But I kind of just need protection. Kind of sucks that I don't have a good way to kill the weak bat swarms, but I can kill the strong bat swarms, which feels even better. Lock Lancet. So my late game would be if I could evolve Clock Lancet and Laurel. But we're nowhere near getting to late game. Mostly because I don't get enough experience. Which is what Rune Tracer is supposed to remedy. Extra projectiles, nice. Yeah, 
there was Bracer. Maybe I should have just taken that. But Bible. Clock Lancet or Spinach? Go Clock Lancet. I might take the Arcana where Frozen does explosion damage. Depends what I get offered for Arcanas. Magnet's good. God, Magnet would be better if there was experience on the ground. Trying to do some damage. Especially since I have Laurel Charges. Well, a Laurel Charge. Okay, just get this Rune Tracer evolved. There's a Magnet and a Freeze. Okay. What about Bracelet? I still feel like Bracelet might be good. Feels like Bracelet pushes enemies back a good amount. I should check what other things work with that Explosion Arcana and take those. I know Bible works, I know Rune Tracer works. I don't remember seeing the bracelet on there. Can I check that somehow? Let's see. No? Can't hover it. Okay. There's a magnet on the ground. Somewhere over here? I swear there was. There's a chest on the ground. Do I want garlic? I think so. If I had freezes cause explosions, I think that would help. The other would be a retaliatory damage, but I still don't understand that one all the way. get Rune Tracer transformed. I'm doing damage. We're getting kills. Crap, the werewolves are coming. Okay. Rune Tracer is at six. Crap. Area up does help. Does it help enough? Maybe. That helps. Bible feels kind of questionable. 
just not adding enough. I do need the empty tome, but I really need this room tracer evolution. Duplicator. The room tracer explosions and the Bible explosions seem kind of good from the starting arcana that I took. I do need some food. And I need to backtrack to get XP. Crap. I need to level up. I'm not getting the... Okay, we did get the level up. Armor's good. Give me the armor. There's a box up to the top left. It's a little ways. There's also a freeze. That's helpful. Um, base area up. Rune Tracer is ready to transform. But it felt like even when I got the box at 10 minutes, Maybe the box had just dropped earlier in that last one. Like last time I did not get a transformation when I expected it. I'm trying to kill these elites. So that hopefully I can get a Rune Tracer evolved. I was looking for. I'm moving further and further away from that box. Let's go get the chest. God, it's so far away. 17 minutes. box maybe has an evolution? It does not. Do I have to wait to t till 20 minutes to be able to evolve something? Maybe. There we go. 1825 for whatever reason maybe it's when the enemies summon when the elite first spawned was that elite really chasing me for eight minutes it might have been divine bloodline is one that works armor also affects listed weapons damage and reflects enemy damage i have a lot of armor Character gains bonus damage depending on missing health. Feeding enemies with retaliatory damage gives... That sounds amazing, really. That's what I want. Okay. So what is my max HP? 133. So I'm willing to eat some damage here to hopefully get up my max HP. Okay, never mind. I took damage very quickly. I was trying to get to that food. I'm alive, but not doing well. Okay, forget retaliatory. It'll happen. These things hit very hard. And I knew that. Good number of explosions. I have food on the ground. Okay, which direction is my clock lance going off? It just went off top right, I think. I 
would you do this without Clock Lancet? I don't even know how I do this with Clock Lancet. Duplicator? I think so. We're at 21 minutes. Area up's really good for Glock Lancet. I'm getting stuck on things. Which tells me I should try and move out to an area that's more in the open. Okay, we're getting to the plant phase. Plant phase is good because plants are slow. I do want frozen can explode enemies. Bible transformation would be important, even though so would more armor. Armor adds to my damage, and it adds to my defense. Okay. Hey, it's armor. Good stuff. How are we doing for max HP? 163. I don't think I'm really gaining it, but I still think that one's good. I do more damage if I'm missing HP. It's easier to be missing HP if I have a lot of max HP. Let's just hang out in the frozen enemies. Is it questionable? A little bit. But I have food on the ground. There's a chest. How close are we? How close are we to Bible Transform? Two more levels. We're level six. We need to get to eight. We got this. I don't really want any of these, but it's painful to use that reroll there when I know that I want another Arcana. And really, I want that Frozen Arcana. I could take heals, give you double, but that doesn't feel very good when I don't have like any passive healing. My knockback's really good. Bible Transform would be massive. Yeah, I'm doing a good job keeping the elites knocked back, at least. I just said Bible Transform would be massive. Let's try and get the one more level I need on the Bible before picking up these chests. I could pick up one of them. Maybe it'll have the Bible. Nope. Big plant that can't be frozen. Pretty scary. God, I can't even kill him with the flamethrower. No rerolls. Obtaining gold restores as many HP. What about this one? I think I'm gonna go awake. Okay, I just need a Bible level. That's not Bible. Bracer or hold out for Tiragasu. Bracer's so good right here. Getting stuck on upside down trees a little bit. God, I want to take that chest and I need the Bible transform. I have revives. We just need the Bible transform. Give me armor. And I 
get stronger every time I use the revives. It's good, because they're going to get used up pretty quickly. I don't know how many more I have. Three more? I think so. That's it? And it's a 5x chest. Let's go. This is my chance. We're at 28 minutes. We're gonna do this. What do you got for me? I forgot that I took bracelet. Why the hell did I take bracelet? Who knows? Maybe it kept me alive. Can I evolve bracelet? This would be so good. Can't get to those. I don't see bracelet in here. Wait, there's another page. Bracelet with double bracelet equals triple bracelet. What is this? What? Where's lightning ring? Lightning ring plus duplicator does thunder loop. This thing plus duplicator does something crazy. I have no idea what this is. I have no idea what a few of these are. Very strange. Okay. There are more chests. Um, Bracer was tempting. I can't get past these stupid trees. Triple chest. This is my chance. Okay. So, does this only go to 30 minutes, or does it go longer? Because if it goes longer, I should be trying to evolve Clock Lancet. And Laurel, really, but one of the two, at the very least. Slowly making my way down south. I'm only level 40. We're supposed to get to level 80 in here. How? They need to start dropping red gems for me. But I can't kill the ones that would be dropping red gems. Also, I don't think they are dropping red gems. How am I doing for HP? 238. Hey, there's death. I have Laurel plus Clock Lancet. As long as I pay attention to the direction that Clock Lancet is going. Nope. Ah, I couldn't. Okay. We got there. Also, the bat swarms keep going. So we can keep getting XP, second death is a problem. Okay. I still have a revive. Can't remember if I have two more, or if that was it. Doesn't really matter. With two deaths, there's not much I can do. Just hope. Line up my Bibles. Looks like the bats stopped. I think I have one more. Is that it? I didn't unlock anything from that. You know what? It's just like personal pride that I made it till the end. Unlocks. Supposed to reach level 80. Okay, so those three are going to be tough. Inverse Gallo Tower. Instead of those, I should just work through the easy things. So yeah, next time, we're going to work through easier unlocks. I didn't get anything new. No, definitely not. All right, for now, that does it for this video. Thanks for watching.